students you all must have known that the steam engine was invented by James Watt and how it was answered the woes of the artisans now let us know in detail about this invention James Watt an English craftsman who made machines understood that the steam had strength to move enormous weights as a result James Watt developed a machine that would run with steam and which did not require men or animals to drive it he showed the invention to bolton an industrialist and the two entered into partnership to develop such machines bolton helped in investments and paid a salary to james watt the agreement was that if profit was made bolton would take 2/3 of it and the remaining would belong to watt james watt thus developed the steam engine they made many steam engines sold them and made so much profit as it was understood that machines could be made to run on steam many new machines to do different kinds of works like weaving spinning manufacture of tools vehicles ships etc came into existence this is how the steam engine of james watt helped in developing new machines the period between 1750 and 1850 saw the emergence of the factory system the new machines and steam power replaced the simple tools and manual power the place of production shifted from homes to factories the workers were brought together to the factories to work the machines replaced the minor tools and handloom and the goods were produced on a large scale Now let us look at who owned and managed the production facilities. The capitalists were the individuals owned and managed all the facilities of production. The capitalists were the people who invested money for the raw materials, machines and the workers. They were the owners of factory and owned the raw materials, machines and the finished products. The workers worked for the wages unlike in the guild system in which they owned the goods they produced the early factories had a dreadful environment to work 